Well, meantime, the national average ACT scores for the high school class of 2022, they're actually their lowest in some 30 years. Yeah, and for this one, you have to go all the way back to 1991 to find lower scores. The first instinct may be to blame COVID, but this actually the fifth year in a row that scores have been in the decline, highlighting an issue that existed pre-pandemic. Brianna Erdman from the executive director at Erie's Sylvan Learning says the issue can be traced to several sources other than just COVID-19. A shortage of teachers means more kids in a classroom than ever before, which limits individualized attention needed to ensure a student understands core skills. A lack of core skills in reading, writing and math can make more complex concepts hard to grasp. These students do not have their core skills that they need to take these tests and get the scores that we're hoping for them and be college ready. Colleges are also seeing a significant increase in students who need to take remedial courses when they enter their freshman year. Nationally, conversations have really revolved around the use of those standardized tests at any level. Brianna noted that teaching to a test is not really a problem, she says, as long as it's a good test.